T++ shampoo is used to treat dandruff and other scaly, itchy skin conditions such as psoriasis or seborrheic dermatitis. The medication contains coal tar, which is a keratoplastic drug that works by causing the skin to shed dead cells from its top layer and slow down the growth of skin cells. This helps decrease scaling and dryness, as well as reducing itchiness from these skin conditions. It is recommended to use T++ shampoo daily for the best results. Apply the shampoo to wet hair and scalp, lather and leave on for a few minutes before rinsing thoroughly. This can be done at any time of day, but some people find it most effective when used in the morning. Make sure to carefully read and follow all the instructions on the product package. This shampoo is only meant to be used on your hair and scalp, so be careful to avoid getting it in your eyes, nose, mouth, groin, or rectum. If it does come into contact with any of these areas, make sure to flush the area with cool water for 15 minutes and wash your hands after use. It's important not to apply this shampoo to any broken or infected skin unless your doctor tells you to do so. When using the shampoo, make sure to wet your hair and scalp thoroughly. Apply a generous amount of the shampoo and massage it into a lather, allowing it to remain on your scalp for several minutes before rinsing and repeating the process. To prevent the shampoo from getting into your eyes, try to keep them closed while shampooing and use a washcloth or towel to protect them. You should usually use this product twice a week, or as directed by your doctor. The dosage will depend on your medical condition and the type slash brand of the product, as well as your response to treatment. It's important not to use more of the medication than directed, as this won't make your condition clear up any faster and could increase the risk of side effects. If your skin condition doesn't improve or gets worse, especially if it covers a large area of skin, or if you think you may have a serious medical problem, make sure to seek medical help right away. T++ shampoo may cause skin or scalp irritation or staining of skin or hair, especially in patients with blonde, bleached, dyed, or gray hair. If you experience skin irritation, stop using the product and consult your doctor or pharmacist. If your doctor has prescribed this medication, they have determined that the benefits outweigh the potential side effects. Long-term use of this product may lead to hair follicle problems, so contact your doctor if you notice new skin bumps or acne in the treated area. Although a serious allergic reaction to this drug is rare, seek medical help immediately if you experience symptoms such as rash, itching, swelling, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing. If you notice any other effects, contact your doctor or pharmacist. If you're in the U.S., you can report side effects to the FDA at 1-800-FDA-1088 or at www.fda.gov medwatch. In Canada, you can report side effects to Health Canada at 1-866-234-2345. Before using T++ shampoo, make sure to inform your doctor or pharmacist if you are allergic to it or if you have any other allergies. This product may contain inactive ingredients that can cause allergic reactions, so it's important to talk to your pharmacist for more details. Before using this shampoo, also make sure to inform your doctor or pharmacist about your medical history. This shampoo may make you more sensitive to the sun, so be sure to completely wash off the shampoo before going out into the sun. It is recommended to avoid sun exposure, tanning booths, and sunlamps for at least 24 hours after using this shampoo, unless your doctor directs you otherwise. Other medications may also increase your sun sensitivity, so it's important to ask your doctor or pharmacist for more details. If you get sunburned or develop skin blisters slash redness, be sure to tell your doctor right away. Before undergoing surgery, make sure to inform your doctor or dentist about all the products you use, including prescription drugs, non-prescription drugs, and herbal products. If you are pregnant, this shampoo should only be used when clearly needed. It's important to discuss the risks and benefits with your doctor. It is unknown if this shampoo passes into breast milk, so be sure to consult your doctor before breastfeeding. Before using T++ shampoo, it's important to be aware of any potential drug interactions that could affect how your medications work or increase your risk for serious side effects. It's important to keep a list of all the products you use and share it with your doctor and pharmacist. Always consult with your doctor before starting, stopping, or changing the dosage of any medicines. If T++ shampoo is accidentally swallowed, it can be harmful. 
If someone has taken too much and is experiencing severe symptoms such as passing out or difficulty breathing, it is important to seek immediate medical attention by calling 911. Alternatively, you can also contact your local poison control center for further guidance. In the U.S., the Poison Control Center can be reached at 1-800-222-1222, and in Canada, residents can call their Provincial Poison Control Center for assistance. This shampoo may stain your clothing, so be careful when using it. If your doctor has recommended it for you, do not share it with anyone else. If you forget to use the shampoo, use it as soon as you remember. If it's almost time for your next use, just skip the missed one and use the next dose at your regular time. Don't use extra shampoo to make up for the missed dose. When it comes to storing T++ shampoo, it's important to keep it at room temperature. Different brands may have different storage requirements, so be sure to check the package labeling or ask your pharmacist for the specific instructions for the brand you are using. It's crucial to keep all medications away from children and pets to prevent any accidents. When it comes to disposing of T++ shampoo, it's important not to flush it down the toilet or pour it into a drain unless instructed to do so. Instead, properly discard the product when it is expired or no longer needed. If you're unsure about how to do this, consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company for the proper guidance. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.